Hey, we need to try the Hachong Kai. Yeah, let's move on to this the... Goreng Pisang Hachong Kai. So, Goreng Pisang. Oh, wow, good. Mm. <laughs> The chili is not your typical ayam penyet chili. No, it's not. It's not. Right? What usually ayam penyet chili is super, it's super spicy. It's super spicy, yeah. And not bad, guys. Senja food center, standards quite high. Okay, good afternoon, people. Today, we are at Senja Hawker. Okay, I'm very excited for this one. A lot of you guys have been requesting for this one, okay? In the west area. Very new hawker, very clean, very spacious, very airy. It looks very different from your typical hawker. I got a special guest with me. Uh, this guest, right, you guys have been requesting for her for the longest time. Yes, it's a her. Usually I spend 100 bucks, but today I spent 150. Because government give money, CDC voucher, I need to use really. And feed the team, not gonna be like me soloing the whole thing. I, I already mentioned before, during hawker concept, we'll try to eat with the guests, let the, let the guests feel comfortable, eat with the entire team. Okay, let's go, find, we're gonna look for her. Come. You need this because you, be, you have been going around introducing. Oh my I god! I only got five. Super nice. They right. gave us like you know, Malayan. Five. Thank you, thank you very much. This one reminds me of Stephen. Every time he drink is like that. <laughs> this one sure must eat. Oh, my favorite. So nice. Thank you very much. I can't sir. be like you, but I wish. You gave us a lot of stuff. Eh. Super nice. Give me Malayan. Yeah, maybe I will give to some of my overseas viewers and maybe if June during gastro, some overseas competitive eaters come, give them this. But I only keep one. Though. I want this one and that one. Okay, guys, this is my guest for today, Annette. Hi. Okay, you guys already know her. No need introduction. Okay, right? she's famous for this. Doing Zaka Naka. Some of your viewers might not know me, all right? I realized I was just nodding my head. Then I realized, no. Do you usually one... call yourself a host, content creator? I have no idea. Sometimes I do musician and Mix video up. video creator. Content creator. But okay. this is my first time filming with her. Yeah, this is my, my first time filming with Zamet. And I'm very excited because I watch all your videos. I watch so many of his videos, I can I can impersonate him. Try it, do it, try it, do it, do it, do it. Let me make the voice lower first. Good afternoon, people. Today, we're here at Senja Hawker Centre and we're going to do a food challenge. So, uh, the map, what we're going to do today... Oh, yeah, we, we're using all our CDC voucher, but we, we're going to try to order food from every every single store. Yes, but but yes. today, right, don't worry, we will not be eating a lot, okay? We'll be sharing with the team. Usually, when a guest comes on the channel, unless the guest specifically <laughs> mentioned that they want to do a challenge, it will not involve a food challenge. Okay, okay, come okay. this store first. So, what do you want? I, I think uh, we should get a fish. Fish? Uh? Because it's an occasion today, right? Oh, yeah, government give voucher. <laughs> uh, yeah, do you perfect. usually get a fish when you eat this kind of Thai Okay, oh, oh, not really, actually, no. Normally, the Thai you order fish means you're very, very, very high. High, high ass, yes. Yeah. Uh, we try to cover each and every store. Okay, like what you usually get for Indian Roja. Fish, fish cake is the go to. I get this one usually. Okay. Uh, what else is good, ah, uh, boss? I am picking it next to uh, boss. Should we just I... get the basic? Yeah, this one, not the famous one, uh. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay, xia mian. Xia mian. You mean mi qi ling, ah? Mi qi ling is sao yu. I like this one. Xia jiang jing. Yes, number one. Yes, number one, ah. Really? Okay, small seat. Oh, hi. Okay. You didn't receive CDC, ah? Oh, CDC voucher accepted here. Big, big down there. I like that it's in this kind of denomination. Yes. So it's very easy to use. It's featured everywhere, like mothership, Sephuli. Okay, every single store. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh my goodness, I love big intestine. Hey, they have three types of intestine. Yeah, I think there's three types. Big intestine, large intestine, and swirly. But guys, this store good one. Uh. The other time I came here with Reina, I tried the the big leg of rice, right? It's, it's really the legit one, right? solid one. Right? You know yeah. one thing that I really like when it comes to dark rice store? I like to get the liver also. Hello! Using quantity, try to sell more and then to cover the cost. Is that a Chengyu? It's a Chengyu, yeah. Can you say again? Boli Duo Xiao. Boli Duo Xiao. Yeah. I'm going to study the dictionary <laughs> later. But okay, lah, I respect that. You know, inflation is global. So despite the fact that the price of ducks went up, right, they try to maintain the price. Support, support. Support this yeah. uncle. Henki. Henki, right? 
Hengi. Hengi yeah, goose and duck rice. We can order a small one. Uh. Okay. It's <laughs> <laughs> not too bad. It's a dining. Yeah, yeah. We're not here. So do you typically have a sweet tooth? Not really, but then some days out of nowhere, if I'm in the mood, then I'll, I'll oh, really yeah. want to eat something sweet. Uh, my friend actually owns this store. Minjang Kui, but modernized. This old grey Oreo yes, cheese. Yes, 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 yes. They, oh my goodness. Very Hi, fancy so, one. Okay, I'll, actually, I don't mind trying this store. This store, right? Yeah. Every time I come to a vegetarian store, I only order meat first. Okay, what do you want? Eggplant. Okay. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I want I want to go. 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 I want to I think we get a set. I want to go. 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 I want it's how much actually? This price is 六块三的。哦，OK。这个价格就会比较优惠。都起价了，以前以前以前一盘也没有那么贵。现在物价都在涨，所以我们没有办法都要跟着价钱都要涨。嗯，好，谢谢。Insane. I, I think this can last me about two two or three weeks. Two or three weeks. Okay, yeah. this this Plus, I, I don't eat out a lot, so okay. I could solo this. Uh. But today is not the case, okay? It's gonna be shared among yes, everyone we're comfortably. Share it. Okay guys, so let me roughly walk you guys through what is what uh. okay. This is roast pork and roast duck. We got a very fancy looking ha chong kai here. This is ha chong kai, I'm not going pisang. I don't yeah, know what I'm going pisang. Three different <laughs> noodles. noodles. And then we've got pork leg intestine, a bunch of stuff. In this area, these are all the Muslim ones. Muslim and vegetarian. Easier lah, so we will not mix the utensils around. Where you want to start from? Uh, I want to eat the laksa. Okay. Laksa is my go-to noodle. Uh, I'm going to start from the lor mee. Lor mee, okay. Wow, first bite, I cannot wait already. You know this laksa stall is so interesting. They have an option of the laksa that is without oh, without hum. hum, right? Yeah, I saw. They put it a, in the menu. A dollar cheaper or something. <laughs> One is the Amoy Street lor mee, which is quite it's quite interesting. Uh. They use the Olsen egg, look at that. The middle is still mm. runny. Right? Good. Yeah. I want to try a lot. Okay, okay, go ahead. Actually, why don't you just share this first? Okay, I can. Because I also want to eat your long meat. Okay, okay. Then I feel very FOMO when you're eating that. <laughs> I want to just eat a mouth of everything, you know. If not, I'll be, I'll be too full by the time I get to the last dish. I cannot believe this is $150. Yeah, but it's worth it, okay? This is like enough for, I don't know, 12 percent. Okay, I need to I need to strategize. You know, I'm what gonna, strategize? I'm just gonna eat the hum. You must get everything one bite. But I I but I'm I I cannot because okay, okay. I need to. Okay, 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 can, can, can. I I I help you. Eat the dog, eat the I feel like we should move on here. Okay. I left some hum for you. Hey, next up, this one I already pre-mixed already. The first time I met her is during YouTube fan fest. And back then, right, she's heavily pregnant. I'm not sure it's like admiration or mix of like both. Close to nine already. Ah, close to nine already. I don't know how she functioned. Uh, okay. I gave birth the week after that. She's like going up and down the stage. Which is heavily pregnant. I don't know. I think everyone had a heart attack. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was damn afraid. Like, <laughs> the other time I went to your house for dinner, I didn't get to see the baby. Uh. Never sleeping. Yeah, sleeping. We didn't want to disturb the baby. Ever since then, right? Like after you got a kid, did you know? Did the did the cost of living went up? Of or, course. Or it's still like very like you don't feel much different. I'm not the kind of parent who would send my kid to ridiculous ten enrichment classes on the. Are on you? The are you? Will you? Will you do that? I don't think I will, but I think if you do that, then it really will be very, very expensive. Some people, they really, really splurge on their children. Okay. For me, I probably spend on getting help because I, I I feel I won't be able to stay at home and take care of my baby. Yeah, actually I agree lah, because it really depends on like, you want to send your kids to yeah, and like I also, what sort of... And I also don't want to send my kid to infant care. Still in general, um, the cost of living of course was much higher ever since I had a kid. Okay. I think we're all very fortunate because I realised Ever since I gave birth, that there are a lot of support measures. A lot of like government give you money, right? You get 11k of baby bonus. 11k already, yeah. 
Hey, yeah, for you, it's how much? Uh? My time, 8K only. Uh. Oh, so you went up. Uh. Uh, I'm far away from having uh, a kid. Uh, okay. So this 11,000, right? How does it work? So it, it just goes straight to a bank account or what? Because, guys, I'm very... Yeah, you must educate me. So it's like, initially, you have to pay 11K to your bank account. Then after that, you have to pay 11,000 to your bank account. Okay. Then after that, you have to pay 11,000 to your bank account. And then, so it's like a baby's account. Yeah, and then time to time there'll be pop ups also. So you can use for all your random baby okay. things. So what you want to have baby with it? Soon now, soon. 11 k So <laughs> how's the law me? Good. Sure not. You, I see your face like not very convinced that it's good. It's not the best law me I've had in my life, lah. But just law me a bit sweet, lah. I'm not sure why. Okay, pass the semen. Okay, let's Nothing. pass it on. Mmm. Mm. Okay, okay lie, lie, try the liver. Okay. Yeah, the duck really quite nice. It tastes a bit like chicken liver, okay. but it's harder. Oh. Yeah. But I like it, I like it. The smell is not as strong. Not as strong, right? Right, it's chicken liver. I think duck liver right, is not that irony. Chicken yeah. one more irony, yeah. It's true. Hey, you must try the chili. Like, oh, grab really? a piece of whatever. So that's the correct chili lah? Yeah, this is the correct one. Just one. not, this one is, I think, for so the pork one. <laughs> This one can yeah. order, guys. Hinky, mm. goose and duck. I like that the kuei chap also has the very medicinal taste mm. for, the, yeah. for the soup. Herbal, herbal. And the duck is still here. Uh. I'm not removing this. Hey, we need to try the ha chong kai. Yeah, let's this move one, on to this the... goreng pisang ha chong kai. It's a goreng pisang. Oh wow, it's good! <laughs> yeah, hot is so good. Eh? Mm. Actually, I hardly eat uh, fried chicken. Mm -hmm. Is it because you're restricting yourself after you give them birth or something? I don't know, I think it's an old age thing. How, the, how as I get older, right? I'm very sensitive to grease. Okay. And I'm very sensitive to sugar. So, so you like tend I to eat, eat healthier, be more conscious. Yeah, it's, but it's, it's against my will. If I eat too much fried chicken, I will just feel Gross. Okay. You know? So this amount still okay. Yeah. Uh, guys, I need to get another one in. You know most hard jump guy, right? The texture might be a bit tough. This one, right? It's got a very nice tempura-like texture. And it's very light. The batter feels super light, which is good. Overall, you don't feel very heavy. You don't feel super greasy. Yeah, actually it doesn't feel yeah. very heavy. And the prawn flavor is still prominent. Okay. How's the chicken so far? Why don't you just Good. use your hand? I provide you wet tissue in a bit. <laughs> because I see how I, I, am, I, I, it, I want to help her. I'm you know? making it work. Already almost halfway done with this chicken. The people that behind the life. camera cannot wait already. They need to try this chicken. It's really that nice. Hey, how's the food so far? Not good, you must tell me. You know? It's good, good. I finished my hajongkai. I'm very proud of you. Yes. She finished her hajongkai using chopsticks. I'm using disposable ones because I'm going into the, Ooh, yeah. the vegetarian one. I think it's this one you typically eat. Plus I know, when you're not filming videos, you're a vegan, right? Okay, I don't have the luxury to eat meat fun. Usually Why? it's a lot of vegetables, a lot of tofu, but no meat fun and no just good stuff here. Why not? No, because these this are higher in calories. So I'm very restrictive when I'm not filming. I'll buy everything, I'll cook everything at home. Sometimes I cook in bulk. So typically I save out a lot. Uh. You buy everything and bring home and cook, right? You save a lot of money. Uh. If you're eating like me, vegan and all during off days. And for me, right, my spending habit is actually very... Okay, firstly, I don't go and drink. Except for special occasions, like Stephen's birthday, we're going to drink. <laughs> Usually, uh, I don't eat out at expensive restaurants most of the time. Because in between my shoots, I need to control my diet. Most of the time, I'm not spending a lot on, on food or, or just in general. Also, I gym... Okay, people always assume that I go to expensive gym and all. A lot of you guys actually tag me when you see me at ActiveSG. Okay, yes, I go to Active SG. $2.50 per entry. Wait, and so you don't buy a membership, you just... You can buy the membership, so I buy the off-peak one. The off-peak one is for, I think, $60 for a year. Oh. So it's like incredibly... Anyone can afford it, anyone, anyone can work out. So I don't want to hear excuses saying that, oh, I, I don't have money to go to the gym at all. I mean, and the equipment's there, it's okay one. Like I said, like, my lifestyle is very okay. minimalistic one. No excuses, rough to <laughs> okay. So today we spend uh -huh. 150 on food, right? That one is the food portion. Uh. Because government did keep 300. Uh. Yes. So the other 150, the groceries one, right? And you see, I can go three times. Because I go there, then I buy in bulk and everything. The discount in me will always look for discount, the triple options and everything. So really, your, your grocery CDC voucher, you only spend it on food? Okay, which one's your favourite dish? I like the eggplant so much. My favourite is the fake golo yolk. Okay, it's not bad for you. Uh. People always think that, oh, 
You vegetarian food, you eat the mock meats, right? It's bad for you. It's just very high in carbohydrates. That's it. But it's uh -huh. not exactly bad. Uh. What do they use to make this? Uh? Some they use like soy, soy flour. Right? Yeah. Some they use uh, mushrooms, the, the stem of the mushrooms. It's a combination of everything. Uh. Okay. But it's, it's, it's got protein. Right? really good. I can imagine it would be way better if it was hot. It was like boiling, right? Yeah. They deserve so, the beet gourmet or whatever the Michelin thing is. I, I know it's not a star. The the stingray, right? It's got heat, huh? If you cannot take spice and you eat this stingray, right, it's gonna hit you. But yeah. Okay, it's hitting me already. <laughs> but overall, it's quite good. I really like it. They are very generous when it comes to the the, the flavor sambal. is very strong. Yeah. yeah. What a bit of ginger. I like that it's sour. I feel like it's reactivating my taste buds again. You are hungry again. Oh, hey. Ah, okay. And not bad, guys. Senja Food Center standards quite high. Maybe a lot of the Woo! stores are curated or something. In general, most of it is quite good. Yeah. The Hawker Center, right, very spacious, but they got only like maybe 20 stores. And most of the stores, I didn't try every single store, right? because some are closed. Most of the stores are good. Yes. Oh, you're sweating, eh? Is it Dude, too spicy? This thing okay, okay. is amazing, but it's killing me. <laughs> okay, this one. Oh, they'll be sitting out for the longest time. Yeah. The show bar looks good. We have some green chili here, even. I don't even know what the green chili is for. Yeah. Oh. Okay, all right. The show bar is still yeah, crunchy. I'm, for the mian. I'm trying to get the mian to even out the stingray spice from my mouth. Do you the think mixability is still okay. I feel like this should help me more than the meat. So I'm going to hit okay. to this first, then I'm going to eat. Mmm. Shoba. You must try the shoba. The shoba is good. Mmm. Good, right? Yeah. Still very crunchy. You know? Yeah. I think a lot of duck today. Actually, I'm not really a huge salya person. Because mm -hmm. they always cut it like this, and there's so much bone. Yeah. But okay. let me eat one. Okay, the flavour of the soya is good, but a bit tough, a bit tough. Oh, yeah. oh, you eat one can. You're right, Ooh. the noodle is good. Are you okay or not? No, I just recovered. I just recovered from the stingray. I can feel it because I'm not sweating anymore. <laughs> okay, this one, you're very excited, right? Your, all the yes. different tang. I love <clears throat> big intestine. Okay, come, I tried the fen tang. I never tried fen tang before. This is made of flour, right? Yeah, made of flour, made of flour. Uh -huh. It tastes like pig skin. Yeah, it tastes like pig skin. Eh. Because maybe it's braised together in the tzap already. Yeah, I think that's why. Oh, this one looks good. Eh. It looks damn fatty. Both eh. look good. Jiggly, jiggly. Okay, okay. They clean it out really well. It doesn't have any like weird odour or anything. Uh, Do you eat coriander? Yeah, I'm okay. Are you okay with coriander? I love coriander. Okay. Oh, it's so good. This reminds me of Khao Ka Mu. Okay, if you guys don't know what is Khao Ka Mu, the big leg with rice. Yeah, that, that one usually you'll find in Thailand. Okay. So recently I went to Bangkok. Uh, and I realized one thing, oh, there's this phenomenon, okay, not really a phenomenon. When I was at the night market, right? $50 SGD, right? I cannot oh, use really? Spanish. Because now, it's just so cheap, right? Yeah, it was super affordable. But now, right, $100 SGD, right? I barely got them full. But I, then your stomach size. No, no, I'm not. I'm not factoring like very. It's an average day yeah. on an average day. <laughs> but she makes sense, that, Okay, my stomach capacity went out. <laughs> but I feel like you, you get lesser items. So. Back then, the food items like two to four bucks. Now it's like four to eight bucks. So some items can go up to twenty bucks. In Thailand, in the Thailand, night Thailand. Market. No, no joke. You go to Jok Fai, every food item that we bought, right, is about eight to ten bucks SGD. I think I haven't been to Thailand Bank. night market recently. Okay, okay. But there are a lot of Singaporeans who always go to Thailand. Yeah, you guys oh, comment down below. Often. Yes, comment I'm down sure below. they'll know. I think this inflation thing is not just like in Singapore, it's like globally. Are you, okay, you mentioned that you've been, it's been a while since you've been to Bangkok, right? When is your next holiday? We're going to Hanoi next week. Oh, okay. But it's for work. Okay. But I'm extending a couple of days to hang out. You have any recommendation? I have never been to Vietnam. You have never been to Vietnam? I want to go. I want to go there and try the pho. But it's on our bucket list. Uh. Our next trip is actually to either KL or Taiwan. We, but we're yeah, going to you, you travel so much, I would think that you've been to Vietnam. No, 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 never been to Vietnam. Oh, but wow. we, it's on our bucket list. Uh. We, need to, we need to go there and eat the local, the street food there and everything. Yeah, I'm sure you'll like it. You're going there for what? I'm doing a talk Ooh. as part of, I'm a guest speaker. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, so it's some conference thing. 
But then I'm extending a couple of days, so I'll just explore the area. Hey guys, this one is go back. damn good, huh? Okay. Yeah, it's really good, you know. We got we got a mix of the lean and the fattier parts. And the lean parts are so freaking tender. They braise it to the point that it's incredibly tender. Okay. I know you, a lot of you guys ask me if I still live with my parents. Okay, yes, okay. I just that one is my house actually. It's a six-room jumbo. So wow. I have no problem living with them. And given the fact that I'm not married, you should I have enough personal space with the jumbo. For right? sure, it's bigger for sure. Than an exec. Speaking of that, right, because I'm living with my parents, right, they are very happy whenever the government give them like senior bonus thing, two to three hundred bonus that uh, I think the government gives to people that's above a certain age. They want to gonna use it like the toilet paper all this, right? I don't use a lot of toilet. I mean, I don't use that. <laughs> Many, but uh, yeah. So if you don't eat for long periods, you don't use the toilet that often. No la, no la. I still eat. I just eat like food that are more lesser calories. L fewer calories doesn't mean lesser food. A bowl of broccoli and a bowl of like good carrot. The calories difference is like thousands one. Sorry, but I'll about to ask a question. Go ahead. You should probably edit out. Go ahead. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Just go ahead. So much food at one go. Then don't you have to go to have to go to the toilet for super long? People always ask this uh. Huh? People always ask this? Always ask. It's not like you go to the toilet one time and the thing comes out really big. It doesn't work that way. It's just the frequency. So you go a couple of times. It's just the frequency. It's not I'm like one sorry. time. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for asking you this while we are eating. It's okay. It's okay. edit it's okay. that out. But I was suddenly so curious as you were talking about it. This one. This one's sitting out for damn long. The boss damn nice. They bring me this one. You, oh, okay, wow. I'm not going to add this in. Add this in. Suddenly one. You don't eat it. There is pig tail. Pig organs. Eh. Pig organs. Liver. This one is pig tail if I'm not wrong. And then there's intestines. That is ribs for oh, a lot of stuff. Eh. Okay, what you want to take? I think I'll just try the sia. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> hey, the rib is super good. Eh. Four of the bone tender. I'm trying soup. I've been sipping on the soup since just now. Eh. Oh, is it? Quite good. Eh. It's packed with umami. Eh. How are very cool already. It's okay, I'll carry the thing. Don't worry, so many people behind the camera. They will all take turns and eat. Uh, don't force, don't force. Guys. But Annette, is, okay, she's been eating quite more. a lot. Eh. Yeah, I know, I, I have been actually. Okay. Okay, then what's the next place that you... Oh yeah, you said Taiwan. Taiwan. Just Taipei la. Yeah, I want to go there and tackle the night market. Like really, just to see how much it changes. Because like, post-Covid and pre-Covid, right, a lot of things changes a lot. Shiling also, like it changed a lot. I'm and sure. I contact my friend in Taiwan, because the last time I met him was like before Covid. He was telling me after Covid, right, so many restaurants actually closed down. So many places switch hands. Places that used to be doing very well are not doing that well. But places that used to be not that well known are actually very, very well known now. Oh, but why? So, I don't know. Maybe during COVID, they, they, they implement some sort of measures or something. Not yeah. entirely sure because I need to go there. This is why we are going to Taiwan very soon. Okay. You're saving the best for last, hopefully. I cannot be sure if this is the best, but I love uh, Indian Muslim food. Uh. This one, like I say, uh, we save this one towards the end because mm -hmm. so we won't mix the utensils around. Uh. Sorry, hey, he played it very nicely for you. Yeah, I know. Hey, wait, wait, oh, wait, this... dip it in. That one yeah, must dip that's one. true. I don't want the what's the name of this one? Rojak sauce or whatever. It's actually quite good. Got a bit of subtle heat, right? Not too spicy. Actually, okay. Okay, should we move on to the soup? Yeah, you can try the soup. I will work on the roja a bit more. It's quite a bit of carb. The more I dive into that, I think I'll get really full. Can I try this mutton soup? Dude, this is good. This is the right very, weather for kambing soup, is it? Yeah, it's very cow. What is cow? If only it was really hot. Oh, it's incredibly rich. How many years? Uh? 40 years, right? Yeah, 40 years of oh, kangu is there. It's pot and it's been. Yeah. Boiling for 40 <laughs> Hey guys, if you guys like her, uh, please comment down below. I want to get her on my show more. Is, is there like some, some shoots that you really want to do? Like food related right? Not just food related. So I guess experiences wise also. Okay. Because guys, you guys know I went to film at the Taihua Pork Noodle. Okay, which is the OG. The, the only one hawker store that's got one Michelin star. It happens to be Annette and Raphael, like the husband. They met, the first date you all went there. We went there for our first date. Yeah. And back then, they didn't even have the star yet. So that is one of those places that you, I want to go there and become a hawker for a day. For I don't think he'll teach you la. They will teach one, they like me, they like me. The uncle like me. But he got his secret recipe, you know, for so many years. I don't think he will teach la, but I think it's okay to let me become, like go and help out there for one day. How much is this, Steven? 50. This one got two meat la. Fish, veggies, eggs, eggplant and everything, only $7.50. Eh. And the mutton is so good, eh. oh my god. Might be the best thing I've tried today. Wait, this is $7.50? Oh, 
Oh wow. Oh, it's very flavorful. Oh, it's so good. Let's go to the ayam pengat. We will have officially finished all our dishes. Then we decide which was our favorite. Let's go. Let me try this. <laughs> she really full already. Everything now she ate is very small bite. Okay, I'm gonna get everything one bite. Chili is not your typical ayam penguin chili. No, it's not. It's not. Right? Because usually ayam penguin chili is super spicy. It's super spicy, spicy. yeah. The sambal. This one a bit sweet, right? Mm. The rice is flavored very good. Uh, chicken is still tender. They give a very, very big serving for the chicken. One entire, I don't know. It feels like more than a leg. Uh. Okay, I'm back to the kambing soup. She's back to the kambing soup again. This is so good. Okay, the verdict. Which is your favorite dish? I'm torn uh, between these two now. Uh. Oh really? No joke, no joke. Okay. I pick three. Uh. Alright. Okay. Ha chong kai. This one. And this. Okay. Reason being, uh, this one is super, super affordable. This is very affordable. They have set options uh, that is $3.50 only. I am paying it uh, very tailored to the local palette, which I like as well. And the ha chong kai is very different from the typical ha chong kai. Stingray is really good, but might be a bit too spicy for some people. For me, right? Kambing soup. It, for real. Okay, so I'll give you three or so, okay. The kambing soup, the stingray, which I know I die eating it. I think the third one I will go with Kuei Chap. In general, most of the food options here are really, really good. Right? There is not one thing that I dislike. You know some hawkers, there's big misses, but this one, right? Yeah. Most of it is good. Okay, hey, guys. Dessert. Yes, yes, yes. I need to let you try this. I'm going to faster try so the rest can enjoy oh, some yeah, of the so food here. Yeah, so they can they yeah. can enjoy this. I feel like I'm hungry again. I'm hungry. Because I have a separate stomach. Okay, like, 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 cheers. Cheers. Wow, this one looks good. Mmm. I know. This one, because of the crunchy, crunchy bits inside, right? It gives it such a nice texture. I thought that biscuit was going to be like super sweet, but it's not. Yeah. It's just nice. I like the crunchiness. I feel it's a good alternative for people who don't want to eat Typical peanut. Me jump kway, eh? the peanut the peanut version because it's crunchy but it's not as heavy as, as peanut butter actually Ooh. hey thanks oh, for thanks for, no? yes, thanks for treating me today I'm you're welcome, definitely you're very full as I mentioned earlier the reason why we, we want to get her on the channel when I talk about different topics right like the heavier topics right she's the ideal person uh. seeing her from last time as gag walking a pebble until now Having a kid and everything. I watch a lot of her channel as well. Oh, okay, her links will be down in the description. Go and check her out. Thanks. Yeah, I, I feel I like to talk about stuff that I learned, you know, as I grew up. Because I feel when I was younger, I never had anybody who talked about issues that, that they went through as they got older. Yeah, true. And actually, actually speaking of getting older, so I think one thing that I've been very into is searching for all these information. Information, yeah, like I'm more resourceful now. When I had a kid or so, then I also went to put in the effort to go and search out all these resources. And you didn't even know it was 11k. I didn't know it was 11k for a baby bonus. And then I even found out that there's this, I think it's a one-off special payment to $400. Mm. Yeah. We'll, we'll put more of the links down for all these links. Just like you have to give me. So I'll put down in the description so you guys can go and check it out. That's it, okay? So if you, want, you guys want to see more of Annette, okay, comment down below. I'm definitely getting her back on the channel. Better to do what? That one, I will leave it up to you guys. You guys can suggest, but don't suggest getting her to do a food challenge. But maybe... I think my stomach will explode there. I really don't know how you do it. Maybe go and unpack certain places. You know, your childhood favourite. Oh, yeah. Whether it's still around or not. You know, after COVID, a lot of places clo closed down. Or like, go and become a hawker for one day. That kind of, that kind of things. Which I think she will be a good guest. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna quickly end this video so the people behind the camera, which are really hungry right now, can jump in and help to eat some of the food here. I hope you guys enjoy this one. I hope you guys enjoy this concept, which I really didn't eat a lot, but focus more on conversations. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye. Well, first time I'm still feeling so decent after a shoot. <laughs>